Listen to them. Number two, when we forget important dates, they do not like that. You might say, a three month anniversary? Well, yeah. If she wants to celebrate three months, you let her celebrate three months. Amen. <laughs> if she wants to celebrate a year in your new house together, you celebrate that new year. Amen. And don't you ever forget your birthday. Don't you ever forget Mother's Day. I wonder how many men went into service this morning and sat down and saw Mother's Day on the bulletin and say, Oh my Lord, <laughs> I am in trouble. Don't forget that anniversary. Celebrate it. Number three, it drives them crazy when we don't show appreciation and gratitude for the things they do every day. It drives them crazy when we don't share our thoughts and feelings with them. Communication is just key, guys. I know some of us would rather die than talk. But if you want a healthy relationship, God is calling us men to be the initiators in that and communicate. And last but not least, it drives them crazy when we put things off that need to be done now. It drives them crazy. I did a funeral for a man him and his wife were married 62 years. The first time I met him, I asked him, 62 years? How'd you do that, man? And he says, oh, I just shut my mouth, you're five. <laughs> he said, I oh, just did He said, just talk. Just talk. At his funeral, I asked his wife, what are some words that could really sum up this man? so that everybody would know what kind of man he was. And she said this, he never once hurt me. Whew. 62 years. And she said, he never once hurt me. Now that is something to strive to live after. God is calling us men, us women, to follow him in his love. Love is patient. Love is kind. Love is not envious, boastful, or arrogant, or rude. It does not insist upon its own way. It rejoices in the truth, not wrongdoing. It bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things. It endures all things. And brothers and sisters, if that's not a mom's love, I don't know what it is. But it all comes from the love of Christ Jesus, our Lord. Would you please stand as we go forward in prayer? Heavenly Father, we love you and we thank you for this time and this moment. And once again, we ask that you would be with all of our moms, those who have lost and those who have gained, those who have been hurt and those who are healed, God, that they may celebrate this day with joy, knowing fully well that your love, it binds all things together, and your love is going to draw us all back together again. And we pray this in the name of Jesus, our Lord and our Savior. Amen.